Hello and welcome everyone to my second tutorial thing. Uh, a lot of you really liked the last one and hopefully when I do these sort of videos I'm gonna be more confident in talking. Yeah, it's the second one, everybody uh, really liked it. We really like the first one. A lot of you wanted me to do the uh, dragon, dragon option. Yeah, I'm gonna do that again in the uh, last video that I did. I start with this pen, uh, and it's like halfway thickness size, whatever you want to call it, and about under 50, like in the 40s. Uh, Opacity uh, when you're doing the uh, sketch. So I'm gonna do that. So if I sound like really weird, it's because I'm a little bit ill. I'm a little bit sick. I I don't know what it is. It's like a cold or some sort of a cold, but without the runny nose and sneezing all the time. So, sorry for sound like that, and the background noises as well, I'm sorry about that. I'm trying to, I'm going to try and put music right now in here in the background, as you can hear. Maybe we're going to start uh, doing it. Uh, I might do a uh, legendary classic, which, which is the four-legged dragon with the wings. And as you see here, you can use the bar on the left. Go up and down, it goes bigger, down it goes, uh, smaller and the opacity is here, again it's like under 40, I, I do it under 40, I'm gonna burp, I'm not gonna burp, okay great, the way you move the screen, uh, you get your index finger and uh, thumb, I put them both on the screen and you can move it about like this and pinch the screen to move further and spread your fingers out to move. To zoom in, uh, to add layers, like I said in the uh, first video, is the plus here. Me failed at trying to do an arrow. <laughs> here, this, 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 this app, this app, uh, plus, plus uh, symbol to add layers, and that's the menu which I showed you in the uh, first uh, video. If you haven't watched the uh, first tutorial, I'll link it in the description and you can find that. Let's... Let's begin. Okay. So... What I did... Uh, was the basic sketch, the starting sketch of the dragon that I'm going to draw, and I use the uh, transform tool to move the image around, and I use undo and redo to delete the uh, lines that I was doing in the uh, previous section when I was sped up. So. Uh, I'm not going to speed up the sketch line art because I need to show you how to draw this on here on Autodesk. I did, uh, as you can see in the uh, sped up version, I did circle here for the head, uh, circle here and circle there for the uh, the body. Uh, the wing is basically a you could say skeleton. Uh, for like the drawing, do the uh, fingers, they're like the wing fingers, that's what I call them. I know it's really weird. <laughs> then for the feet, the feet here, I did uh, like little toes, claws, tell me when I'm doing the uh, like claws and your feet. Uh, and I did the uh, exactly like the uh, pony sketch that I did uh, last time. Did the same the exact thing with the uh, arch shape here. The uh, arch here for the front legs. 
before I just do that and repeat here for the um, other leg as well somebody's coming upstairs and now it's really awkward now cause they probably heard me so yeah that's cool so you can <laughs> the tail is like a simple card card thing here just a line basically but yeah that's the uh, starting sketch of the dragon now I'm going to draw now on to the uh, section with the line art sketch uh, I set the opacity to 100% and get the brush down to like 1.5 size uh, the pen which I always use do the eyes and I usually do um, not as uh, wide as the uh, pony uh, drawing that I did or that I do I do, I mostly do it like quite small with like a point to like this bit of the eye and I do exactly the same with the other eye as well like that uh, I'm not sure what design I'm going for, I'm just going to do a basic dragon design, quite simple uh, and just like the uh, like I do with the uh, how it all uh, ponies and like other stuff I start I uh, do the uh, snout exactly to the head right here but a bit more longer because it's some more like a slim sort of dragon type thing I might do like a beak sort of mouth like that you go up there like that like a slight curve or you just want it like a line coming down here it's like an axe sort of shape that's where the uh, nose is gonna go just do a simple arch and then do another cheek like that and for the chin you just do a point like that to fit the dragon's design of what you're going for or you can just do my design and you do the uh, jaw uh, just like a simple line across and then up like that and then I do a slightly out forehead right here I'm not too out because it just looks stupid and then I do it more out like that to fit the uh, sketch complete the head now you're now I'm just gonna do like horns and like uh, like webs along the side here but you can do whatever you want to your dragon and you do like a little base here the horn to go and then do like a slight curve with a point and you just adjust the head so it actually fits with the head and then do the other horn here and if you want spines you can do the spines here just do like a line coming from down in the middle of the eyes here and then do points going down curved like up here on oh you don't have to have spines on the dragon if you don't want to I'm just doing it because it's cool alright and after that uh, I'll do the eyes because I didn't do the eyes on the uh, last tutorial so to do the eyes like that just like all walls everything going from this part of the eye to the top to the bottom here and then when I draw dragons I did a torso like a bit like a bit more outwards. And then you'll not have the neck uh, like a bit thin. For the shoulders, you do exactly like that. So it's rather simple. And then uh, for the uh, feet, you do the claws first. So it's just like a bent triangle. 
and then you do a bump on the uh, end bit of the uh, toe finger, whatever it's called, and you just do a simple wave like that. And then underneath is is the same, and then you repeat. Back legs, uh, you follow the uh, sketch that you done, and you go down to the feet, and the 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 back leg feet is exactly the same as the uh, front legs. So you just do the same bent upside down triangle. And then go up from here, from this part of the uh, sketch, and add a little bit of a bump. And for the back, you just go up like that for the uh, tail here. And then it's the same for the body as well. And then this leg is exactly the same, except it's a bit more 2D and like squashed or just add like little toes and that for aesthetic reasons and the tail goes up like that for, by following the uh, sketch that you did it doesn't have to be perfect because this is the uh, sketch phase so it's be as short or as thick or as long as you want. You could just do like a little arrow, you know, at the end, or nothing, or like a mace or something. The wing is a bit, a bit more complex than the actual body. So what I do is start with the I start with claws on the wings exactly the same with the uh, feet and I go from there you can do like a little bend like that or you can just do it straight like that I do like a little bend like that so it fits it and then go to the uh, bend bit stop there do the web here and then do another web like that, so it fits the uh, wing and go along here with another bend like that here, just do lines to show where the uh, web ends and starts and do the uh, elbow for the wing little point I mean, your dragon doesn't have to have wings like this, but I use your, your dragon wings like this. And you have the web coming down from here. From like in the middle where the bend is. And you do it either by the uh, thigh here, by the hip, or by the actual joint here, or have it like that. Or have it like that. Have it like on the tail. I usually do it like that ish. And have it going along here so it wigs which is the joint of the wing. Just add like a little bit of adjustments. Yeah, you can have the web here as well. It doesn't have to have that, but I usually have it because it looks good. <laughs> and yeah, it's the uh, wing. And you just uh, merge the uh, the layer with the uh, wing by doing the uh, merge. Not merge all. Only merge once. The merge is here. So you merge it. And then switch to the uh, sketch layer and clear it. And you have your dragon sketch. And now it's you can change the opacity of the uh, layer. Uh, 
I said in the last video how it works. Uh, go to about 30 or 50, whatever you choose, and then continue with the lineup. Again, you could do whatever you want to your dragon that you drew by using this tutorial. Or if you were just watching, because you were just watching. <laughs> I'll link the other one in the description. I still don't know how to do a, a uh, outro. If you like this uh, video, then like and write down in the comments what you think about this. Next. If you guys want to see another tutorial, I'm gonna do like colouring, how to colour on here, and how to use the uh, bucket tool, which is here. So that was that's gonna be next time, and yeah, sorry for sound like really dead because <laughs> I'm a little bit ill. That's why I sound a bit more quieter than usual. Anyway, bye.